The Catholic Bishops Conference of the Philippines rejects radical distortions about the Marcos dictatorship as the Philippines commemorates the 36 People Power Revolt anniversary Friday, February 25. In a pastoral letter signed by Caloocan Bishop Pablo Virgilio David, the CBCP urges Filipinos to diligently seek the truth as society is plagued with quote-unquote a pandemic of lies. While it does not name any particular candidate, the CBCP warns against radical distortions in the history of martial law and the EDSA People Power Revolution. The EDSA uprising toppled the late dictator Ferdinand Marcos, whose son Bongbong Marcos is leading the 2022 presidential race. Ang, ang pinatatamaan lang na, naman natin dito, ang tinutumbok talaga natin, ay yung totoong nangyari. Huwag lang nating babaluktutin yung totoong nangyari. Panindigan naman natin ang totoo. Labanan naman natin yung nagsasabi ng hindi totoo. At kung malinaw sa inyo kung sino ang hindi nagsasabi ng totoo, di huwag, huwag iboto yun. Ang iboto natin yung pumapanig talaga doon sa totoo. In related news, Presidential Bet and Vice President Lenny Robredo says the EDSA People Power Revolt's true spirit lies not in the surnames of its cast of characters, but in the love and freedom that Filipinos fought 36 years ago. President Rodrigo Duterte, meantime, also asked Filipinos to honor and thank people who quote-unquote, continue to keep alive the legacy of the EDSA revolution. Ironically, his daughter Sara Duterte is the running mate of Bongbong Marcos, whose father was ousted by the revolt.